This is NBC 10 News. Well, this Friday is World Hepatitis Day, a day to raise awareness about a disease that many people don't even realize they have. Dr. Stacy Truskin from Philadelphia Fights CA Difference Program is here to talk about the most serious form of the disease, hepatitis C. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. So what can you tell us about hepatitis C and how do you get it? Sure. So hepatitis C is what we call a blood-borne pathogen. It's spread through the blood, coming into contact with blood, although it can also be isolated from semen and vaginal fluid as well. The most common modes of transmission are mm -hmm. sharing um, syringes or uh, injection drug use paraphernalia with other individuals. And hepatitis C is often called a silent infection. Most people don't have any symptoms when they're infected and can go decades without even knowing that they have it. So there's people walking around out there who, who have it and they don't know it, they have no idea. In fact, 50 to 75% of people living with hepatitis C have no idea that they're infected. Because they have no symptoms, That's right, right? Right. So what can be done? First of all, it can be cured, right, in most cases? Absolutely. So in 96% in of cases, yeah. it can be cured. And there are even more therapies coming out that can cure those 4% that aren't cured with treatment the first time around. So if folks remember nothing else, it should be that hepatitis C is curable and you should get tested because knowing is the first step. And that takes us to the CA Difference program. Tell us right. about that. So CA Difference is really about getting tested and being aware of your status. And then we have amazing navigation teams that link individuals who are tested into care. Um, but everybody should be asking their primary care doctor for a hepatitis C test if you've ever been at risk for hepatitis C or if you've been born between 1945 and 1965. Those are considered baby boomers mm -hmm. and the CDC recommends that everyone born in those birth years be tested for hepatitis C once in their lifetime. So you're encouraging people to either ask their doctor or get involved with your program so they can be tested and find out. Exactly. Excellent. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Appreciate it. Now here's what you need to know. We have all this information on our website. You can find out your status by coming to Philadelphia Fights See a Difference office at the John Bell Health Center in Center City, Philadelphia, all this week from 9 to 5. And again, it's all on our website.